Howdy good folks of the internet. Uh, I was debating doing this video into two parts, but we're just going to have a giant 20 minute long video of my Super Nintendo games. We're going to go ahead and get this started. Uh, there is a giant pile of them, as you can see by this giant wall, and we're just going to go ahead and start it. So we got Final Fantasy 2, Final Fantasy 4 in Japan, classic. We got We're Back, A Dinosaur Story, another classic. World Cup USA 94. This is the 1994 World Cup uh, when the USA was playing soccer or football for everybody else. Paid a dollar for it. Classic. We got Super Mario RPG Legend of the Seven Stars. Classic. Timon and Pumbaa Pinball. So this game was awesome on the computer back in the day, but uh, the SNES version is terrible. It's a classic. Killer Instinct. Classic. Star Fox. And whoever had this before me, they marked out their name. Uh, so I'll never know who had it. So if this was your copy of Star Fox, let me know in the comments. NCAA Basketball. Got this one for a dollar as well. Classic. We got Biker Mice from Mars. This was a TV show in America. Thanks Konami for bringing the classic to the Super Nintendo. Earthworm Jim. Another classic. We got Super Battle Tanks 2. I don't have the first one. So we have to go by this one as being the only classic that there is. Tasmania. It's a classic. Lord of the Rings. Thank you eBay for putting this giant barcode on the on the sticker uh, so that way I know forever that it's uh, barcode number 431572. Uh, if you were the previous owner of this, thank you for putting this giant sticker on the sticker. We got Original Harvest Moon. It's a classic. If you haven't played it, you need to play it. Also, this game is worth like $500 now. Bomberman 2. I don't have Bomberman 1, but Bomberman 2 is a classic. Bart Simpson's, uh, oh, sorry, just The Simpsons' Bart's Nightmare. Uh, this is also a classic. Uh, it's by the TV show cartoon The Simpsons. It's a classic. We got Turtles 4, Turtles in Time. This is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I don't have Turtles 1, 2, or 3, but this one is a classic. Also, Mike Stover owned this before me. So, Mike Stover, if you're watching this, I have your copy of Turtles. It's now on a famous YouTube video. Then we have The Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. It's a classic. Got The Jungle Book. Disney's The Jungle Book. Got this for two bucks. It's a classic. We got the combo game, Tetris and Dr. Mario. Uh, I have Tetris and Dr. Mario on the, on the regular Nintendo, but you can't beat the player's choice copy of Tetris and Dr. Mario combination for the Super Nintendo. It's a classic. Have a nice day. It's Faceball 2000. In this game, you go around and you shoot, shoot bullets at other faces, and they tell you to have a nice day when they, when they slaughter you. Monopoly. You'll recognize this copy of Monopoly in the video that I did called uh, Take a Trip Down Memory Game. I think it was episode three. I uh, did Monopoly. It's a classic. Family Feud. Got this for two bucks. If you have a family and you want to feud, you can do so in this classic game. Sim City. So in Sim City, you uh, build a city. And it's kind of like The Sims, but except you control an entire city instead. It's a classic. Animaniacs. Animaniacs is a classic. It's a good TV show. It got rebooted on Hulu this year. Toy Story. This one's a classic. 
this game doesn't actually work, so I've never actually gotten to play it. I also don't think it's a real copy because it's missing everything on the back, but it's a classic. Donkey Kong Country 2. Whoever owned this before me, uh, I can kind of see your initials. It looks like KY, uh, but wh whoever owned this, uh, please let me know if you're watching because this might be your copy, but I own it now, so it's in the famous video. Mickey Mania, A Timeless Adventures of Mickey Mouse. Oop. Mickey Mania, A Timeless Adventures of Mickey Mouse. In this game, you do Mickey Mouse and you jump around in um, you know, Steamboat Willy World in the first one. It's a hard game, so I never really get past the first level. It's a classic. Donkey Kong Country. This game is made by Rare. Uh, whoever owned this before me, you, you own the same copy of the other Donkey Kong Country because it has the same initials right here. Uh, so if this is your copy, you're, it's now in a famous YouTube video. NFL Quarterback Club 96. So the NFL is the National Football League here in America, and they made a game in 1996 called the NFL Quarterback Club. This is a classic. Radical Psycho Machine Racing. This game is a classic. They also put the $2 sticker right on the sticker. I've never removed it because I didn't want to rip the sticker, but it's a classic. Lemmings. Yoshi Safari. So in Yoshi Safari, you need the, the Super Scope. I don't have the Super Scope, so I've never played it. It's a classic. NBA Jam. It even has the warning, this is a protective label sticker right here on the side. Even on the other side, so this is a protective label because I guess people were very adamant about opening NBA Jam and jamming it into the Super Nintendo because it is a classic. Coming up hot is the red case. Spider-Man Venom Maximum Carnage. Even still has the blockbuster video sticker on the sides. That's how you know it's a classic. Joe and Mac. This isn't my game. I borrowed it for somebody. I actually didn't borrow it. He left it here. If you're watching this video, your game is still here. This is your game. Your game is in my video. This is not my game. This is not my game and does not belong here. Scooby-Doo Mysteries. So, Cody, if you're watching this, Cody, um, this is your copy. I have your copy of Scooby-Doo Mysteries. It's now in a famous YouTube video. Hope you enjoy it. Now we have uh, Roadrunner's Death Valley Rally. I believe this is a racing game. I actually never tested it out to see if it worked, and I didn't know I even had it until just now. But it's a classic. Breath of Fire. Breath of Fire is the original one. It is a classic game. It is made by Squaresoft. It's a classic. Home Alone the Video Game. Home Alone the Video Game, you are home alone. And you have to make sure that you stay home alone. It's a classic. Home Alone 2. Lost in New York. This time you're home alone in the entire city of New York, and it's a classic. Mario is missing. In this game, you're Luigi, and Mario is missing. It's a classic. Uh, it's made by, the I think, the same people that made the Oregon Trail. Great stuff. Donkey Kong Country 3. The same guy didn't have the initials on this one, so I assume this copy was never owned before I owned it. It's a classic. Super Mario World, instant classic. Mario's Fun with Numbers. This game was also made by the Oregon Trail people, so it's an instant classic. Final Fantasy 3. This Final Fantasy is Final Fantasy 6 in Japan. It's a great game. One of my top three Final Fantasies. Classic. The Lion King. The Lion King has a name on it. It looks like Myra Deck or Mira Deck. Mira or Myra, if this is your Lion King copy, it is now in a famous YouTube video. It's a classic. Aladdin. Still has the Blockbuster label on it. That's how you know it's a classic. 
but whoever owned this before me, um, I can't read your name. It looks like it started with an L. So if this is your Aladdin copy, I now own it, and it's in a famous YouTube video. It's a classic. Jason, I own your copy of Super Scope 6. Thanks, Jason, for giving me this, but it didn't come with the Super Scope, so I don't think you traded in the Super Scope at the same time. But this is a classic. Super Tennis. Got this one at Toys R Us. Toys R Us is gone now, so it's classic just like this game. Mario Paint. I can't tell who owned this before. It looks like it says Kyla. Kyla, if this is your Mario Paint, I own it now, and I have the mouse too. The mouse is not presented in this video, but I am able to play this game. Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Benjamin is the main character. This game is called Final Fantasy Mystic Quest USA or Final Fantasy USA Mystic Quest in Japan. It's a classic. Let's put it up here. Pilot Wings. I am notoriously bad at this game. It's a classic. Super Empire Strikes Back. Here's Luke Skywalker. It's a classic. Uh, Claymates. It still has the movie gallery sticker on the, on the, the uh, game case. That's how you know it's a classic. One of my subscribers sold this game to me at a GameStop. We were standing outside the building. It's a classic. Now to show off some other games. I have a Super Famicom. I can't speak Japanese, but I have the Japanese version of Super Mario RPG. It probably says The Legend of the Seven Stars right here in Japanese, but I can't read it, so I can't tell you what it says. Then we have Final Fantasy USA Mystic Quest. It's from Japan. It's still in the box. We're going to open the box right here on camera so you can see it. Ruin the collector's value. There it is. It has all the stuff inside. It's even got the Japanese book, Japanese art book here. Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. I can't read it. can't read a single thing this says, but it says Final Fantasy USA in it, and it's from the Mystic Quest line. So that's how you know I wasn't telling a lie. It is the Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. I said that right here. We got Final Fantasy V in the box still. This is also for the Super Famicom. I can't speak Japanese, so I'm not able to read it. Here's the back of the box. I don't know if I showed the back of the box for Mystic Quest, but here's the back of the box for Mystic Quest. Great. Super Famicom Final Fantasy V. We're going to take it out right here, ruin the collector's value. Check that out. Place the box right over here. Comes with the booklet. Even has the... Uh, I'm not sure what any of this says, but it says something about plugging it into the wall. So don't have that. It's still got the plastic on it. Look at that. Plastic complete. We're going to take it out of the plastic. Put my fingerprints all over it. Place it right here where it belongs. Going to open this up. I believe the map is still in here. I believe this turns into a map. Actually, I'm not sure what this is doing. We're going to open it up together here. Find out what it is. Oh, I can't read it. But it shows the entire job system here on the map. So you can see that there are that this game was way too hard for America. There's the map right there. I told you there was a map. So whenever you're in trouble, just check that map. I'm gonna place this one right over here as well. Last but not least is Lufia uh, the, in the Fortress of Doom. So we got Lufia in the Fortress of Doom still in the box. We're going to take it out, dump all the contents out. Check that out. We still got the game, so you know it's for realsies. I've got the game right there. I've got the, the guide. It shows you simple, plain English, so that way I can read it. Oh, what's this? We got a secret subscription to the Nintendo Power Player's Guide. We get a free player's guide. Player's guide for free. I'll get this incredible player's guide. All I have to do is call, oh, I can fill out this form, 
fill out this form right here, send it in to Nintendo, and they'll give me a free player's guide. Also, if I call that toll-free number, y'all can also call that toll-free number. It's 1-800-255-3700. So that's 1-800-255-3700. If you to join the club instantly, you just call that. It's toll-free. don't even have to pay a single penny for it. And then the last we have in here is the map. There's a map. There's always a map. So we got the entire map. So we don't actually need that player's guide. Uh, the map actually dictates where all we go. So we don't have to worry about any of that. So there you have it. So that concludes the Super Nintendo. Uh, it looks like it was a little bit short of uh, 20 minutes. So uh, make sure you smash subscribe, tell 10 friends, uh, show them off the uh, Super Nintendo collection, and then comment down in the section below uh, what Super Nintendo games I'm missing, like EVO, The Search for Eden, and Earthbound, and Chrono Trigger. Those games have eluded me for so long and I'm not paying retail price for them because they are crazy expensive. So if you have those games and you want to donate them to the channel, we won't accept them. You have to tell 10 friends. That's the only thing we accept. Thank you.